strong first round for your men here at the Yellow Jacket Invitational. The team is currently tied for first place, and individually Jake Hedge is in second place after shooting a 69 in the first round. Uh, just your early thoughts on what you saw out here today on your men's side. Yeah, you know, we got off to a good start and uh, and really kept it together. We shot four over par as a team, and, and Jake played really well to lead us at three under par. Uh, we're tied with Rocky right now for first, and uh, it's going to come down to tomorrow's performance, which will make it pretty exciting for everyone. And, uh, you know, I think that uh, we have a lot of potential that we haven't played to, which is a good thing that we can build on that. And, and really, this is the first competitive round of the spring, even though it's pretty late uh, in the spring. Uh, so to, to take that, you know, I, I think nothing but good of it. And uh, we'll come out and we'll build on tomorrow's performance and see how it goes. Any individuals today that you thought really stepped up other than, you know, Jake leading the way for your team and uh, within that leading into tomorrow, any performances you really have your eye on? Yeah, you know, first of all, I got to tip my hat to Rocky. They had a player shoot uh, 600 par 66, which is an outstanding uh, score. And, and Jake shooting 300 par 69 were the only two red numbers out there. Uh, everything else was over par. And so I think they hit the ball really well. I think Houston Bradbury, and uh, he really stepped up, played well, and shot one over 73 along with uh, Austin Berg. So with those two and uh, everyone else on our team uh, playing steady, I think that uh, we'll have a good chance tomorrow to come out and produce. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.